it was important to have the cadence group that really worked with us. They held our hands in many, many ways. Um, the cadence team held our hands and they continue to hold our hands in terms of helping us understand what are the right things to do, what are the things we should start to question ourselves on, and they've really been a very, very solid uh, uh, foundation in terms of helping us uh, move forward with texting. You know, this is not technology. <laughs> yes, it is, but no, it isn't. It's, it's, it's how we communicate with people. And of course, in today's world, everybody carries around their cell phone, their, their mobile phone, and they're, they're texting all the time. Um, and so it is probably, in my mind, the, the most powerful communication tool we have today, given the, uh, I'll call it the student population and how they look at that mobile phone as their connection to, to the world, if you will. Texting is probably the most powerful communication tool we have available to us today. And if we don't learn by doing and put it in place with the intention of making sure that people are engaged with using the tool, then it just becomes, I hate to say it, another spam. Use the cadence people, listen to them. You don't know it all. <laughs> and, and they've got lots of experience with this because this is where they spend their lives. So leverage the fact that you have a company here that wants to help and wants to be sure you're thinking things through before you do them. And don't be so arrogant as to think you know it all. Use Cadence, use their resources, use each other and listen. I think listening is probably the skill set that I emphasize the most in my leadership environment. But however, you've got a great team here in Cadence that is willing to offer ideas and thoughts. And you just need to be quite honest, shut up and listen. <laughs>